Welcome to Mr. Sir Sports. We recently hit 1,000 subscribers, so thank all you guys for that. If you want to join the family and be entered to win a MacBook Pro and experience all the NFL news that's important that you need to know, hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell so you're notified when our videos go live. When we hit 10,000 subscribers, we're giving away a MacBook Pro, like I mentioned. So don't forget to hit, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell so you don't miss a video. Thank you guys again and enjoy the video. One of the top NFL prospects in this year's draft, Jalen Carter, who originally was supposed to go number two overall, most likely behind Bryce Young, is dropping in the draft, obviously, for the off the field issues. And some of the teams that have reportedly been interested in him are the Seahawks at five, the Lions, the Raiders, and the Bears. So out of those teams, who do you think is most likely to land Jalen Carter and take the risk of the off the field issues that he might have? Because Personally, I think if he gets past Seattle, I'd be really surprised at five, but I think there's no way, no way he gets past the Lions at six because I think the Lions are a team that are willing to take a risk, especially if it pans out. Imagine having uh, Hutchinson off the edge and then having Jalen Carter, arguably like a generational talent in the middle. Good luck stopping that defense. So what do you think ends up happening with him? I know the Bears have been talked about uh, pretty frequently as a team that could get them, and I think that why why not why not go go somewhere like Chicago? I mean, th their defense is some is one a unit that could use a lot of help, and I feel like we've talked about that the Bears are a team that would be willing to take a flyer on a guy like that. So it would be interesting if he does last that long. Maybe there's a chance they could move up again after they move back from number one, possibly to to draft him. But I think at the end of the day, one of those teams is going to get a pretty good player, and they'll be lucky to have selected Jalen Carter.